He's not very energetic next to his buddies over there on the platform. He's alone. I think he's hurting. The search is on tonight for this sea lion in distress, spotted on a dock in Oceanside with fish netting wrapped tightly around its neck. New at 5, ABC 10 News reporter Michael Chen reveals why the rescue could be a complicated one. I think he's uncomfortable. Almost immediately, Sharon Bagley knew something wasn't right as she kayaked in Oceanside Harbor Saturday evening. As she got close to this dock, she saw the netting around this sea lion's neck definitely digging into his pelt and skin and it's raw and pink. In a Facebook Live, Bagley talked about what she was seeing. Sense of it being heartbreaking. She says the sea lion was tangled in three to four feet of plastic fishing net, part of it wrapped around its neck. Probably about half inch inside of his fur, a raw open wound. She tells us the sea lion appeared lethargic. He's not very energetic next to his buddies over there on the platform. Not bothering with the typical warning bark when she got close. Bagley and several friends contacted SeaWorld. A SeaWorld spokesperson says the sea lion is an adult weighing over 400 pounds. We're told the severity of the situation is hard to gauge without a closer look. According to SeaWorld, Harbor Police and lifeguards are looking out for the sea lion. The rescue itself could turn into a complicated process. Because the sea lion has to be darted and sedated, the setting has to be just right like a beach. On a dock, a sedated sea lion could lunge into the water and drown. I'm out here looking for my little distressed friend. Among those now trying to find the sea lion is Bagley. I'm pretty determined. I go every day, sometimes twice a day. If I can play a role in that, I'm happy to do it so that he does not suffer. Michael Chen, ABC 10 News. Uh, if you do spot that sea lion, you're asked to email or call the Sea World Rescue Team at 1-800-541-SEAL. And there are also links on our homepage at 10news.com.